Hi, my name's Dave Greger, Penflex's Inspection Coordinator, also a Certified Welding Inspector, Certified Welding Educator, Non-Destructive Examiner Level 2 in three different methods. Let's look at the history of welding and how important it is, not just to the metal hose industry, but to our everyday life. Let's start with a brief history of welding and its importance to mankind's developments throughout history. Its importance is generally taken for granted and unknown to the average person who is not in this profession. The first welded item found was from around 3500 BC, more than 5,000 years ago. It was a gold dish with a handle brazed onto it. Later, historians called this period the beginning of the Bronze Age, which was followed later by the Iron Age, when methods of fire forge welding using borax as flux, joining those materials together, were perfected. These advances in welding technology led to more effective tools, weapons, cookware, and hardware for mobility. These periods of human history were named after metals, such as the Bronze Age and the Iron Age, and shows just how important they were to mankind's development. Going forward a few millennia to the 1800s, we saw the very first carbon rod crater and arc that melted metal. Later in 1881, two Russian engineers accidentally discovered using a DC battery and two carbon rods that arced and melted two pieces of metal together. This would eventually be refined to the TIG welding or stick welding processes. Advancements later led to coating of electrodes for arc deoxidization and stabilization. AC welding and underwater welding processes later followed. By 1941, the TIG process, which we'll be focusing on today, had been fully developed, patented, and was used in manufacturing and industry. Since then, welding across all industries has improved metal construction and made possible all large machinery, bridges that span great distances, and supported thousands of tons of vehicles, ships, airplanes, and vehicles that move tens of millions of people and millions of tons of cargo around the world. Tall skyscrapers that define cityscapes, storage tanks, boilers, nuclear reactors that give us our electricity 24 hours a day, and of course, all the piping infrastructures that support those systems. It is an essential process for everyday living that has been perfected over the millennia. It is really amazing when you consider all of these things, isn't it?